I want to go ahead and just show you guys my December favorites and I'm going to kind of go through this quickly because I know this video is probably already very long. So let's just go ahead and start with um, some palettes that I've been loving. So I really wanted to talk to you guys about the Stila Eyes of the Windows palettes. I've been obsessed with these this month. The one that I've been loving the absolute most is the shade Mind and it's probably my new favorite palette. It's kind of competing with the chocolate bar right now, but I love this. It's an all matte palette that gives you so much awesome variety. You can literally do a very mauve light look. You can do a very cool tone look. You can do a very warm look. You can do a very dark look. Like you have every look you could possibly need in this one tiny little palette. Hello. Amazing and like such good quality and it's only $60. I know it's kind of like pricey. I said only but I mean it's so worth it and you get this amazing packaging that's all like this plastic um mirrored packaging and it's so pretty. The other one that I've also been loving is in the shade Soul. I like this for the times when I don't want to do completely matte and I want a nice lid shade. I kind of pair it with the Mind palette. I use these gorgeous lid shades that come in here but you also get some awesome mattes and I really have been loving them this month. I've just been really almost using them every single day and really grabbing towards them so had to definitely show you guys that. So next I have a foundation that I've really been loving and this is the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation. I've really been liking it because it gives you that matte full coverage look and it does last a very, very, very long throughout the day. So I really like that about it. It also has a very like lightweight kind of moussey texture. So I really enjoy that about a foundation as well. But I am still trying it out and I'm also trying out two other foundations that I don't yet want to claim as favorites. So I'm kind of just trying those other two out as well. It's the Becca Foundation and the Maybelline Fit me the new one. I'm trying those ones out and I will be having reviews on those two for you guys. So next I want to mention the two, the new Too Faced uh, Cocoa Powder Foundation. I have absolutely been loving it. I have mine in the shade Light Slash Medium and it is so amazing. It smells like chocolate so your whole entire face smells like chocolate and I really really love it just because it gives you awesome 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 coverage and it gives you a really nice finish. It's not completely matte but it gives you like a nice like healthy finish. Next product that I really want to mention is the Benefit Dallas Blush. I have been enjoying it so much. It's that perfect like mauve tone kind of blush. I feel like it gives you an extension of your bronzer but also still gives you some color. Next I've tried out two concealers that are super popular. The NARS Creamy Radiant Concealer I have been just obsessed with. I have mine in the shade Chantilly and it's extremely light and extremely bright. It gives you full coverage and it actually doesn't crease. These two concealers both do not crease. This one is the Cap Von D Locket Tattoo Concealer in the shade Light 16. Both of them don't crease. They give you awesome full coverage and I'm such a concealer junkie. I don't know why, but I just, I love these two. They've been really, really good to me this month. I'm still trying them out more, but I definitely, they've been huge favorites of mine. Next is the Anastasia Brow Gel um, Clear. It's not tinted or anything like that. This stuff is literally like glue to your eyebrows. Sometimes I have trouble with my eyebrows, like one hair will go out of place in some of my makeup pictures and that's so annoying but when I use this stuff it literally is like glue and your eyebrows stay perfect all day. So love setting my brows with this recently, I've been really loving it. Next is a new eyeliner that I've been trying out. This is the NYC Liquid Liner. I really like it guys. I think I like it more than my L'Oreal and Your Liner. It is a little bit of a thicker brush so it's kind of harder to work with. If you're a beginner I still would recommend the L'Oreal one. But this one's super black, super pigmented and it does dry to a matte finish and it gives you a really nice thicker wing. Next it's this Lit Glitter. I also I want to include the Lit Adhesive uh, Glitter Adhesive but I don't have it right now. I have been loving it. It works amazing. The adhesive really makes the glitter, like no glitter fallout at all and it makes it not messy at all. It really holds the glitter on your lid and it lasts all day. It's amazing. I have mine in the shade Beach Baby and I did two holiday makeup looks using this exact glitter. I'll link it down below for you guys. But I've been loving it of course for the holidays. Next I've been loving the Stila Foil Kitten Shadow. This one is absolutely amazing. Perfect like sparkle to the lid and little fleck, uh, flax, flakes of texture. I've really been enjoying it a lot this month. I've actually been using it a ton. I usually wouldn't use products like this a lot but that's how much I've been loving it. Next and last for my uh, December favorites are these Stila Liquid Lipsticks. I've been loving them. They last all day and they're just perfect. I have mine in the shade Patina which is like a dusty rose and Aria which is like a raspberry shade. Absolutely amazing. They smell so good. The texture and the quality is so really 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 good so I've been obsessing over those this month. So that's pretty much it for my December favorites. Like thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it and I will definitely see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. I'm absolutely obsessed with the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette, the original one. So when I heard that they were coming out with a second one, I had to jump on it. I actually did purchase this palette.